The federal government faces a shutdown in two weeks. That is if the U.S. House and Senate cannot come up with an agreement on a funding measure. KCA United Washington correspondent Jesse Tenner takes a closer look at the debate. Shutdowns are stupid. Most Republicans and Democrats agree with South Dakota Congressman Dusty Johnson. But how to avoid a shutdown is still largely partisan. My initial idea was to extend that to January 15th. Speaker Mike Johnson supports a second temporary measure that would fund the federal government through early next year. There's some good arguments for that. But Johnson is also entertaining another idea called a laddered CR. It would extend government funding agency by agency for different periods of time. We'll see how that goes. I think we can build consensus around it. Translation, they want to shut the government down. House Democratic leader Hakeem Jeffries worries any GOP plan would come with unreasonable policy changes or steep spending cuts attached. That devastate and undermine the health, the safety, or the economic well-being of the American people. But Indiana Republican Congresswoman Erin Houchin supports another temporary measure to resolve differences with the Senate. We need more time to accomplish that. And even though the steps Kevin McCarthy took to avoid a shutdown in September ultimately ended his tenure as Speaker, Republicans say even their most conservative members will likely give Speaker Johnson some needed flexibility. There's a bit of a honeymoon period that comes with being a new Speaker. In Washington, I'm Jesse Tenor.